Hello everyone, we are getting to Chicago, Illinois. This is the next city that we are going to be visiting right after Michigan. And I've been dying to come to Chicago forever, so I'm very excited. We're only going to be here for two days, but we're going to try to do the most of it. Finally in Chicago! I've been dying to come to Chicago since I was a little kid. My dad grew up here in Chicago in Madison Avenue and I've been hearing about this place ever since I was born and I have always so wanted to come to Chicago. Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground And I, I really want to know, really want to know If I We are in the Leaning Tower of Niles here in Illinois. It's a replica of the Tower of Pisa in Italy. And there's tulips here too. Look at this. <laughs> when looking for things to do pet friendly near Chicago, I found out about this place and I thought it looked so cool. It's a lot bigger than what I was expecting. I was expecting like it's a replica to be a lot smaller, but it's actually pretty big. It's in the middle of the city of Niles, like 20 minutes away from Chicago. It's 3 o'clock and the bells start ringing. The hotel that we wanted here in Chicago is sold out so we are looking for another one in the phone really quick in the meantime Venus and Apollo are just hanging here with us We made it to our hotel here in Chicago we are staying in the Westin it looks pretty nice we are right outside Chicago we are not staying in downtown because in downtown there was not a lot of area for Venus and Apollo to go to the bathroom and this one like is right outside there's a little bit of area we are in the seventh floor guys are you so tired? you guys are so tired tomorrow we are gonna explore Chicago and we are gonna go to the Arbotarium so you guys need to rest yeah What about you, my old man? Are you tired? Are you so tired? We're the only people in the parking garage in our floor, so he's running them 
before we go to downtown to take a few pictures and then we are going to the arbotarium today we have a long day so we wanted to tire them and that bag is our dirty clothes he was gonna put them in the car yesterday we couldn't find parking to take pictures so we came really really early in the morning is seven o'clock It feels almost unreal to see Chicago so empty. Yesterday when we came, it had so much people everywhere. We made it to the bean. The name is Gate Cloud, I believe. But everybody calls it the bean, so I'm calling it the bean. When looking online for information about the bean, uh, there was a mix of information. Some places said that it was pet friendly, other places said that it was not pet friendly. So we decided to go check it out. If we couldn't, we will take the picture from afar. If no, we will make it all the way to the bean and take pictures with it. We were there, like I say, at 7 o'clock as soon as they open, and we saw another doggy near the bean, so we decided to go, and we did took a bunch of pictures. Later on, a security guard told us that the bean is not pet friendly, so we apologized, and we took off with Venus, Apollo, and Shrek, and we keep exploring Chicago. So have in mind, it's not pet friendly, but there's no signs anywhere that say if it's pet friendly or not. Shrek! Here is the famous Chicago theater. We were supposed to come last night to take pictures, but I was so tired. I didn't go in the mood of coming. This is the largest Starbucks in the world, so I needed to go inside and check it out. I love Starbucks. Uh, have in mind that they don't have the same drinks that they do have in the regular Starbucks. They have like more fancy drinks, more fancy coffee. I just got a cup of cold brew and keep going. I just wanted to come inside and check it out. And we are back in the road up to our next destination for tomorrow. Yeah, it's really easy to see. 